So after run going running this weekend, I ran about 15 miles and my new Garmin Vivo Active watch was tracking my run up to about 12 miles and then it reset. So after talking with a few friends and doing some research online, I found out that you actually have to install some software updates for the watch. So I'm gonna walk you through on how to do that. So what we wanna do is we wanna connect the USB power adapter or cradle to the laptop and then what we want to do is we want to sit the watch in the cradle put the watch in the cradle what you'll have to do is you'll have to download the Garmin Express software and I've included that link in this video. So I'm going to have to go here and add a device. And I can, the Garmin Express software is waiting for my computer to detect the device. So it's detecting it. It found it. So I want to, once it's found it, I want to click add device. and it's gonna make me create a Garmin Connect account. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So once I've signed up, the Garmin Express software is gonna ask me to add a nickname for my watch. I'm just gonna call it View of Active, the default name. Click Next and it's finished. I'm going to click No for the anonymous data collection then click finish. Now it's going to set up my device. So now it's checking for updates. It found a software update available. So now I'm going to install it. I click install. Hit I accept the Garmin software license agreement. And then I hit continue to run the update on the Garmin Express software. So now it's copying the files and downloading the software update. My software updates have finished. So I've disconnected my Vivo Active watch from the cradle. And now I'm going to install the update. So I press, press the uh, update button on the watch. So it looks like the patch is finished and has been successfully installed. So that wraps up the tutorial for the Garmin Vivo Active watch. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial and the video. Thanks.